I actually thought about this uh, the other day. I think I was driving by myself on them long drives, and I always, you know, laughed at myself. And I, was, <laughs> I got 50 miles to go. Uh, but uh, it was a big match, you know. I was the Wolverine brother. Death <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I am sorry to interrupt this regularly scheduled programming, but we have breaking news. I'm Matt Hardy for BCR Television, VH1 News. On August the 17th, 2013, I have just been informed that I will be taking on Davari in the main event of the Wrestling Cares event in Los Angeles, California. Ladies and gentlemen, I am not here just to be a talking head. My attributes allow me to tell you yours at home the truth, to preach the gospel. Here at VH1 News, that's what we do. Sean Navarre has worked for many, many major wrestling companies, and during his time with those companies, he has been portrayed and profiled as things like a terrorist. He's also been portrayed as a member of Al-Qaeda, a member of the Taliban. He's even been a Muslim who rides on a flying magic carpet. All propaganda! Here's the facts, America. Sean Navarre is an American citizen. He was born in Minnesota. The only crime against America he has committed is being an asshole. And Hold up, we have some breaking news coming in right now. We understand that both men will be seconded. They will have people in their corners. Okay, here we go. In my corner, I will have the gorgeous, vivacious, beautiful, stunning, breathtaking. Oh my God, look at that booty. It's amazing. Virtually perfect. Ready, Sky. And in Navari's corner, he will have Ryan Shamrock. There is one positive piece of news coming in on Navarre right now. We understand that in 2012, he choked out a homeless man on a train who was being a nuisance to all the other passengers on the train. Unfortunately, a choke out will not be effective on Matt Hardy because I am not homeless. We're actually being told right now that even though Sean Navarre started his career with the WWE as a manager, he is actually a premier world-class athlete, a phenomenal wrestler, and he went on to win many championships during his career with the WWE. Hold up, we've got a fact check coming in. Scratch that, no championships. Make your plans now to attend Wrestling Cares, which will be held at the Sheridan Gateway LAX. It's a huge card. Besides me, Twisted Fading, Devari into the Afterlife, where he won't be rewarded with the 72 Virgins. Also performing that night will be former WWE Women's Champions, Candice Michelle and Katie Lee Virtual. Also, the very handsome Adam Cole from Ring of Honor will be on the show. Plus, many, many, many other great superstars. Do not miss it. August 17th, Wrestling Cares. For BCR Television and Version 1 News, I'm Matt Hardy. Go fuck yourself, Los Angeles. Hold up. That's not my line who put that in the teleprompter. What? Did Jeff do this to me again? Oh my God. Stay classy, Los Angeles. I'll see you on August 17th when I whip Devar's ass. He's coming back. I got a family to feed. Get with it, boy.